I get get some output. So x1, x2, w1, w2, then some function. Right? By asking that the function, then finally you can get up. So this is one set x1, w1, then activation function, I get get that. Similarly, x1, x2, x3, x4, x right, like this. I can change the variety from 0 to 1. Entire tree will be changes, right? My my score in my class 0 impact all. It is the relative scoring. My score is 100. Again, impact all. My friend score is 50. Constant 50 not an issue. All are 50 is not an issue. That's right. My friend score is more, maybe 45. This reflect all. Similarly, with the reflection, which one is the best? That is the machine learning. So, you want to train machine like this, ever the logically, mathematically. So, machine knows only that 0 and 1 is correct. They do the equation mathematically only, he read. Right? Like this. Now, I come to my our problem. Right? What is the BJ? Breadth of the joint. Breadth of the joint. Height of the column. Strength, AST, steel at tension, bottom, length, strength, water parameter. So I took 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 parameters. I is in the each parameters weight W1, W2, W3, everything is length. Finally, I can get what? Shear stress. Right? This is my topology. Right? 11 inputs are given, 12 hidden neurons, and one on output. Neuron. So, our hidden neuron already told you know this is do that I'll calculation here and there. So, this is very easy, don't think about this big. You have some basic knowledge in the Python coding, right? Pandas Python. Yes, no? yes, so you can code it, you can get the d equation, you can get y equal to mx plus c one equations. So, another equation y equal to mx plus c, one of the number equation, you can calculate you know, what is x and y. You have the two variable, two equations, you can get solved, you can get the solution. In, similarly, you can get the n number of equations, n number of unknowns, there are one computer coding, put this value, you can get all those things. This is a big dynamics. Right? Now, <clears throat> then different model also, this is complication of, again I want to show this, this complication. Uh, whenever you go for any theory, no, first you should understand what about the basic load path. Either compression occur, tension occur, or both torsion. This is very very important, bro. Keep it in mind: tension, compression, bending, shear, torsion. Civil this one, five mandras, right? With these five only we are playing. Some place the bending, shear, buckling, axial, tension, compression, torsion. That's all. That is our only five, right? Keep it in mind. Here we have the tension, compression, so on, so etc. You know that my time will pop. My friend is waiting. Right. <coughs> John C. strength of interior beam column joint. We have the different formulae in different. Then IS codal provision also. Right. You can look at this formulae. Then V, this is the joint is equal to 1.5 AE into FCK. The joint strength they predict with respect to characteristic strength of that concrete and as well as area of the steel provides. Then AC code we have that 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 variable only. They included breadth of the joint and height of the joint. Then American code, this also have some limitations. Then European code, then other members that developed the uh, embryic equations also, they have the n number of variables like a HP, breadth of the beam, depth of the beam, so on and so, etc. My point of view is also not enough. I go for something. For that, we developed the model. Myself and Dr. Shreyas Sarayev. Shreyas Alagundi developed the model for this using that MATLAB. Suppose you can Google it, you can get this word. How did this? Uh, then, AN model was developed through the Lernbach Mantrat algorithm. LM algorithm applied in the Tranlinium MATLAB coding. It's available, just you can Google it, you can get the MATLAB, I think may be available in your institute also. You can sit along with your computer science people, you do this analysis, you can get it. Right? Then, I have that, 
coding, output and all. From the artwork, which one is the best? Right? I need some statistical data, right? Right? Best student, outgoing student, without no career in the history of BTEC. That is the best outgoing student. Distinction, no career. First class, are you it's okay? Within the period, 6.5 CGPA, we can get the first class. These are the classes. <coughs> My model it gives some result. Tau is a 35 Newton minimum square. Right or wrong? I will fix the sum strategy. Right? So I will check with my average, mean, median, more, standard deviation, and all those things. My reading is this, my answer is this. How much deviating from standard? For example, my, my target is 20. Standard deviation is around 13. It's not good. More deviation. Right? Similarly, we can have that different model. Then pre-processing data using that. These are the simple uh, network also. Data normalization is necessary to test up the NRC network training. Basically, uh, what, what I am trying to say here means, so don't take that all raw data. You can filter the data using some mathematical technology. You know the RMC? Redmix content. Redmix content. Very good. This is similarly yes, is correct. <coughs> then one more thing is mathematically. Mean square. So you can draw the graph words, right? X and Y. Y is M X plus C. In the top you can get R square equal. What is that? Uh, root mean square. Root mean square value. It's represented now 0 0.9, 0 0.8, 1 point, sorry, 0 0.9, 0 0.8. Even points to also come, sometimes one also come. What is the meaning of that? R square value. Why should be square? Why not a square? Huh? Avoid negative. Negative means what happened? What is the real meaning of R square? Yes? Yes? Tell me, friend. Ah, most of the people cross that is right? R square. Yes or no? Yes, sir. Right. If R is 0, what is that? R is 0. R is 1. What is the difference? What's next distance? 0 and 1. That is the relationship between that X data and Y data. Right? These two is like good friends gives one enemy zero. So no relationship exists, it's zero. Good relationship one. Point five, okay. Point two five, this side. Point seven five, that side, this side. So we have the sum that are like this. This is here and there. Zero to one, like this. So here also. These are the variation of data with respect to the mean square root. The data for AN modeling, data for AN modeling, the data set we can develop, data set, the training data, testing data, validation data. Training data, testing data, validation, what is there? So, everything you have to take one basket, cook, can eat. Good summer means, I will say my madam, good. Bad means, try next time. Like that. See, change these ingredients. Okay? Add summer, sorry, um, dal, and reduce the chili and all. See, we will make it right. Similarly, here also, testing data, I am a testing person. Then, training data and validation data. Right? How much I take? Usually, I take 10%, 20%, 30%. Age, which one is gives more good result that I will take. Right? I explain a lot in the activation function, what is the need of activation function and all. This is the proposed architecture plan. This is our aim modeling. Then coefficient of correlation, RMC, root mean square error. It's correct. Then scatter index. So these three only I took. Apart from that, we have the n number of statistical model to identify the acceptance and rejection, rejections quality. 
it's available you can explore is not limit i open for all right so from this i can get the different values right number of hidden layer 1 2 3 different layer told you know then i can get that what is the coefficient of correlation with respect to the training data the testing data validation data this is a rnc right so from that i take that uh, fourth layer 1 2 3 4 layer 1 2 3 layer is gives not any sense it may be 0 or 0.5 i don't need then cc value 0.9 it's good good right like a father ask i got 98 why not 100 similarly again i go for the some d right so so among this training data testing data validation data which one is a gives better results this 11th so that 11th hidden layer what is what are the parameter what is the weightage mm -hmm. y equal to mx plus c x is this in this is a length of joint breadth of the joint or all those things o is nothing but o is nothing but what is the shear strength m is nothing but slope this is a c is a constant we calculate what is the m that is our a you can see this topology is correct so that only i take out right from this i can get a equation that equation how it's related then among this uh, statistical value i can take this 12th layer is a good then how it's vary from the other hidden layer also i can choose then this is my good topology topology used for that am modeling here therefore am 11 12 01 model with 11 nodes input layer 12 nodes the hidden layers and the single layer of input layer is optimum am architecture so how it works like this i'll tell you so this is the basic architecture so 11 parameter among this which root is correct <coughs> i'll go different root okay like your uh, swiggy boys supplying food you know so they will first where is the shortest route to reach and in case of three more order which one is supply first second third similarly here also my destination is swiggy home who is order that this is sugi bye you want to go here so he try n number of route which one is the best you carrying all right this is the food on food food three then where i want to go my model is i consider this all by 11 photograph 11th model so good this thing i so what is relationship i already told you know some predicted value and Uh, exact value how it's varying and all i given here then this is my matrix the mathematically i can get this weighted w1 i can get like this then b1 that is a bias b2 is another bias simply right tell me friend as he see here so my topology is like this w1 x1 plus b equal to this for example w into x plus b equal to w1 x1 plus a1 so y equal to m x plus c y m x plus c. this is the model right i can get this model simply i can get the different variable for example bj means breadth of the joint h is height of the joint i can take k1 k2 k3 different factor i can multiply it i can get one simple equation this is my e final equation to calculate the calculate the shear strength capacity of my beam column joint y output is nothing but shear stress the kt you know that then k2 is know that how can calculate k1 k2 previous slide is given what happened for my slide K1 is given. What is the formula? K1 is equal to by 1 plus e power this formula. Then I substitute the value of K1, K2, K1, K2, K3. Multiply with this constant. 
up to this we are trying to find this only this numerical value then all the rest of things is fine so you put give the input this my formula you can get what is the shear strength so this is the end right then after that i will calculate this my shear strength using my formula how it's related with other formula also for example uh, for in case in case, in case I example to calculate my formula under is code how it's relates so this is the uh, test data this is the predicted data how it's for example this um, dot is there no i will make it the straight line here possible so this straight up and down so more r square is equal to 0.9 means good like that i can yes this is the relations between my formula and the others so finally we developed this mathematical model to calculate the what is the shear strength of the beam column joint using different uh, parameters with different uh, optimization technique using machine learning right this is the today's uh, uh, topic so how can this machine learning concepts is applicable for our beam column joint only for exterior beam column joint similarly you go for interior beam column joint you can go for the treatment plant you go for population prediction you can apply for the transportation analysis traffic signal so on so you can apply this concept how many members may be accommodated at particular time in your main gate possible right you can take the data so we can make it that algorithm possible right suppose 1 team people 3 4 team do the project so which team is the best with respect to playing the data you get that some question is you can make it the database right you can develop your own model which team is the best in what way what is scientifically the best don't tell about that qualitatively quantitatively is good or bad right i can say 80% is good 70% is good that is engineering right that is a engineering so we have the tool in around us we can use this tool effectively can apply any field that's why the it communities are ready to take engineers not a civil engineers not a electrical engineers not a computer engineer tag of engineers only mind only so don't think about that civil only want to do this we can apply for other field also and hard hard for um, whole heartedly you welcome for other technologies also from other department this is applicable for the satellite location gps location prediction target some people shoot now one particular target different uh, our soldiers shoot that particular object they may not be shoot exactly the center right who is the best shooter right right one shoot is a target is center another it may be away from that all all this gun shoot it may be the center is a good similarly right so we can apply this field any things now hereafter you may be equipped with this other new technologies is very useful for your life also so this is my end of my presentation i hope maybe learn something about the what is machine learning what is a deep learning what is a input what is a data what is a weighted then what is a ann how it works what is applications of in you know, a civil engineering field so how you can apply in other field also so i slightly touch this is open to you right this is not a limit you can explore yourself you go for advanced learning course <coughs> you can get more idea you can learn all those things okay with this i want to conclude the talk so i want to finish this so any doubt any discussions you can um discuss with me if it my data set i can answer right with this range also yeah any discussion not a question any discussion discussion is easy than questions right correct how i can conclude <laughs> you understand our 
nothing or you maybe understand full i don't know i hope it's my past sense you all are member yes yes yeah Oh, yeah, third year. Fine, good. Good name. Sir, everything, sir. Very good. Sir, now if a project find a project same with my coding, I have done it from other company. Yeah, this is good question. Also, need questions. For example, two into two is equal to four. No need of any coding. Computer gives. You should know the logic first. So you want to multiply or divide or you take the values and all that. So coding is very simple, bro. No need, bro. No, no need to worry. About this, sir. In case of you put in the matrix, it's very easy. You know, multiplication of matrix, right? This is a very, very uh, what we call a uh, very simple tool. The no need of coding in the deep. Simple. You find us like that. Readymade tool available in MATLAB. In that uh, Python also. You can use RMC is available. You can open the Python, right? Programming. Can have so click directly. You can give the or always you want to customize it. What do you need? So logic is the must. One day you sit along with your computer science friend. No, he will teach you lot. Right? How to make it that you know that concept? Why I will multiply x one into x two? That is yours. How we can multiply? Computer people will do, calculator will do, other person will do. All on a lot of online tools available. You feed this online tools also it gives, right? That is, I think, no need to depth of deep coding. Small coding is enough. That is very simple. Go YouTube. One week sit in front of the computer. You may be learn coding not that much difficult. My point of view. Yes. Yes, my dear. Okay, fine. Good question. Fine. Yeah. Now, a uh, strategy is simple. I am as a base, very, very novel person in the civil. From sound standard itself. Sound standard is. I want to study only the structures. My area is now. Choose computer. It's right. What is the need at present? Right. I am a degree about. Not degree about the pro. Need. But you want to adapt. the new technology for initially you coming inside what is the need of computer science engineers similarly equivalence as need of other engineers also we are only give the problem to them they will solve the problem with using the computer so we are the problem creator we are the problem solver also they are supporting so for that so you should know understand the concept of civil engineering using that big calculator Tag of computer science, you can solve our problem like a calculator. Brain is civil. Don't worry, don't feel coming inside for the civil, going for the computer science. Vice versa also not an issue. So AutoCAD, STAD, and SAP and all enhancing the professional skill. Professional means our skill. That is a curricular, extra curricular, co-curricular things. That is a machine learning, this and all those things. So C, C plus plus and all. Now it's need bro, all places see. So don't store in your mind. I want to learn only AutoCAD, start, start, no. no. Computer science also see, also Python also. You can speak no. 